And the wonderful thing about this conference is it's us telling our own stories. It's our narrative said in our voice, said using our bodies, a, a, a lovely combination of art and performance. I think what we've seen here is resistance and how powerful and creative and innovative women can be. For me this event is really special because I just, just discovered that I'm not alone. There is some hundreds of powerful women around the world doing the same like me. For the first time I kind of feel I'm in a space where I can say what I want without being judged or criticized. I think this is going to go so big and it's going to go global and it's, as I said earlier yesterday, it's the Olympics of the peace. I think, I think it's going to be no, something no. huge. This is a unique conference. There are a lot of artists. You know, I've been to many conferences and there were a lot of lectures and talks, but here the, everybody is very short. I like that. Positively surprised by the presence of uh, so many important uh, uh, activists, artists. This is an army of women for freedom. This is when they tear down the barriers. We are really bearing the brunt of uh, most of uh, what, what happened between the superpowers in the past. They have been through very challenging life, but uh, we don't know about each other's problems and, uh, and about ways to come forward. So it's very important that we come together and we share the common problem and the common solution. If you look at all the countries of the world where they stand, it is men who brought it, who created the situation as it exists. We need to make changes in the life of every woman around the world and make sure that they are safe, respected, and protected. There's a lot of women who are abused who think they are alone. So the fact that you have all these amazing women, be it using their art, their music, their uh, activism, their devotion, it gives us hope. To find all of them here in one place, you know, in, in two days, in two condensed days, it's really amazing. This is a means of amplifying, of giving uh, voice to those who are not able to be here themselves and to hear the other voices of women. I've been to so many conferences that talk about women from various either Muslim backgrounds or various so-called ethnic backgrounds and usually the setup is one panel of brown and black women talking about our lives and the rest of the conference white women talking about us. And the wonderful thing about this conference is it's us telling our own stories. I just think it's the best safe space that's ever been created for campaigners and I think as campaigners that's what we try to do anyway, we're trying to create a safe world out there and, and it's actually nice when someone creates that for us. I feel that we can be one world if these women rule the world, not their rulers.